Ahoy there, boys and girls. Hop aboard the SS Wiggle. We're setting sail for giggles. Come on, Sniggles! Hey, everybody. We're the Sniggles. Don't be scared. <laughs> Oh, you're late. It's 6.30 in the morning. Yeah, and I said six. But I guess you had to go to Starbucks. Hey, Tim. Hi, Onema. We missed you at Thanksgiving yesterday, but I heard you and your dad did something pretty cool. Pizza Pete's. Oh, Pizza Pete's? That is cool. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Paul. Uh, I'm Emma's boyfriend. Well, we haven't put a label on it yet, so. <laughs> but we are intimate. I, uh, you know, Pete, Tom, Tim, um, we, uh, I used to go to Pizza Pete's when I was a kid. Uh, I used to love the ball pits, the bumper cars. Yeah, I don't really like getting hit by cars anymore. <laughs> oh. Right, yeah, because of the, uh, okay. Uh, well, I mean, that stuff's for little kids, you know. Uh, Pizza Pete's is all about the games, right? Yeah. Mom and I used to play Zombie House, but... Dad can't, because he's not supposed to hold a gun. Uh, not even a fake one. He gets flashbacks. Excuse me. Miss, you think it's okay for me to park here? Uh, yeah, it says no parking at any time, but I'm sure the loading trucks could just park across the street. Does that work for you? Yeah, that's per... Lex. Hey, Mr. Houston. Old angels sing glory to a newborn king. A fucking furry little monster that's gonna make me a pile of cash. <laughs> Hi, Wiggly. I'm Lex. So you're what all the fuss is about. Tickle my belly button. Cute. <laughs> that tickles. Hold security, we got a shoplifter. Drop that doll. Jesus Christ, Ethan, you fucking asshole. Hey, come on, it was just a goof. Uh, where's my sister? Oh, no. Hannah? Is that what you've been telling me every day for the past four weeks to pick up your kid's sister? Oh, I must have forgot, because I'm so stupid. She's right over here. Hannah, Ugh, come here. Do I got to put a leash on you like a dog or my cousin Oliver? Okay, don't pull her. I'm not. Okay. Hey, Banana. Is today a good day or a bad day? Bad day. I told you to wait in the car, Gerald. No, you know full well why you're not allowed inside. Because you're not to step within a thousand feet of a Cinnabon, Gerald. No, I don't believe you just want to smell them. <laughs> oh my God, look at this line. No, Gerald, keep the car running. I don't want to come out there in 10 minutes to a cold car. Excuse me, sir, what do scissors do? Huh? Hello there. Linda Monroe, president of the Hatchetfield Boating Society. Or perhaps you know my husband, Dr. Monroe of Inner Beauty Rhinoplasty. Excuse me. No, Gerald, you cannot run across the street. No, I don't care if River has to use the bathroom. He can hold it like a man. Excuse me. What? Oh, my God. Gerald, hold on. Becky Barnes is accosting me. Yes, call the police! You can't do that, Linda. You can't just cut the line. Oh, oh no. I did not cut. I bought this spot fair and square. It's all right, lady. I let her in. Because she paid you. I saw it. That's called a bribe, sir, and it's illegal. Or it should be. Oh, look! A valued customer. Good morning, sir. Can I get you a Tickly Wiggly? Yes. In fact, I would like all of them. Wait, what? What did that guy just say? Excuse me, sir, did my ears deceive me or did you say you want to buy all of them? Yes. As in the entire stock of 850 Wigglies at $49.95 each, that's... $44,999, including sales tax. 
Would you like them gift wrapped? <laughs> Hi, Gary Goldstein, attorney in law. I was a little further back in line. Gary, thank God. Are you aware that my client, Linda Monroe, suffers from a rare, little understood anxiety disorder? And any lasting medical conditions which may arise from stress caused on these premises are your liability, sir? I hope you have your finances in order. Get ready for audits. Audits up your ears. Audits in your yin yang. Audits at your wazoo. All right. <laughs> uh, hi, welcome to the Lakeside Mall Cineplex. How can I help you? Uh, can someone tell me what the hell is happening out there? For God's sake, the country is coming apart at the seams. It's a goddamn uprising is what it is. It could be anarchists, terrorists, socialists. Give me two hours, Mr. President. I'll organize a series of drone strikes against the key instigators of this revolt. No, Mr. President, these riots are not ideologically motivated. Make no mistake, this is shopper mania and a fuck ton of it. Uh, now, uh, I know this may sound hard to believe. <laughs> but uh, it seems that what these people are riding over is a, uh, a doll. Bring a link ding when a bell rings. It's only a matter of time till Christmas break. Hallelujah. You bet you are! Jingle! Jangle! If anyone sees two elves in my locker, I'll get expelled for sure. What are you two doing here? We're here to make sure you don't screw up Christmas, boss! That's right! Hey, Chris. Noel! Were you just talking to your locker? Don't worry, boss! She can't see us! Hello, Mr. Prezzywiz. Welcome to Drowsy Town. It's you. Don't be frightened. You're my bestest buddy, one. No. No, I've come to tell you to leave us alone. 